Demon Zan Birthday is so much for clicking on this video and deciding to watch me today. We're back with more Demon Slayer. We are watching season three, episode four. Thank you, Tokito, which I'm interested to watch because we kind of got into some fighting. Things were heating up, so it's going to be a great time. Keep in mind, guys, if you want to see my full uncut reaction, you can check it out by going over to my Patreon page. Link down in the description below. Every time you go there, it really does help me out. So thanks, guys. And without further ado, let's get started. Get him. Get him. Fuck him up. Oh. Okay. It's still moving though. Could we like finish it off? I know I can't really grab people, but I'm still concerned. So if we could just maybe slash it one more time, that'd be, I would appreciate that. Uh oh. Yeah, that's why I said we should slash it again. A pot. Yeah. Nice. Okay. That's what I thought. Glad we figured that out. Good job. Hug. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we got other things to do. It's fine. You figure out your feelings on your own time. Oh. Are you going to help? Yeah. Like, bitch, please. That's the kind of look I be giving. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Huh. So you lost your memories. Did you join the corpse before the memory loss or after the memory loss? I'm guessing after? <laughs> oh, thank goodness. And yeah, okay, so the tongues have like emotions on them, it seems. Oh no. <laughs> Yeah. God, I don't know what we do about this. Oh, you get it? I don't get it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So just gotta keep slicing and dicing, basically. <laughs> so while it sucks to keep slicing them, we have to keep slicing them. Oh no, did he eat them up? Oh. Okay, so they just can't. I thought maybe he like gobbled them up or something. I don't know why I thought that, honestly. That was probably a stupid idea. Ow. Oh. Oh. No. Oh. oh. Just anime swordsman. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Okay, come on, boyo. So where's that 
We're sun breathing. Let's get to it. Yeah, I get it. I know, I know. Oh yeah, you got stabbed and we had gun time. How? Um, you know what? I'm not even gonna ask how he's doing. Never mind. That was insensitive. Oh. So you have some like hyper regeneration, it seems. Because like his tooth came back and stuff, right? Or I'm wrong? I don't know what's going on with them, honestly. They're weird. They're both really weird. The whole tooth thing was odd. I, I'm still trying to figure it out, you know? Please explain it to me. <laughs> Now he's still going. Gun? Oh my goodness. Oh. Welcome back. Oh. Oh shit. I love that we just have guns. It's just funny to me that everyone else has like sword s things and he just says gun. <laughs> it's very American. Oh no. Don't do that. Girl. Yes, girl. I've always believed in you. Oh, I was not starting to doubt you. Nice. Oh gosh. Oh, you see the Oh, that's cool. We're blasting up the idea uh -huh. okay they're doing their best not to die what is this chant that he keeps doing that seems to keep him alive is is it a type of breathing or just a family thing I do want to know. Oh, well, that didn't answer any of my questions, so kind of rude. Away, away, away. Just be careful. Oh, snap. Oh, oh. Damn, what a good, just upward slash there. Oh, okay. Well, we're making it back. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Hi. We're here. Yeah, help your sister, please. Oh, oh, you can just like make more. That's crazy. Oh, good. I thought that was your hand for a second. 
Oh, interesting. Oh, okay, interesting. We good? Yeah, it's very effective. Like crazy effective. Ooh. Great. No, I'm so glad he's back. Miss Kenya. Oh, hello. Oh, no. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's so bad. Oh, children, chop, chop, chop. I need you up. Need you up and on the ground. Not that ground, but like standing upwards. All right. I mean, we have weapons at least. <gasps> yes, girl. <laughs> I'm so excited for her to be back. Yes. yes, girl. I've missed you. That was the end. Oh, tragic. At least we know she's going to be in the next episode. I'm so hyped. I missed her. She's such a little ray of sunshine. I adore her. <laughs> oh, oh, I love these are my favorite ones. Oh. What the hell? Okay, she's wildly popular with the guys, but she doesn't realize it. Oh. Oh, honey. Bless her heart. I love her. Okay, so we got to see a bit more of Genya, which an interesting character. Again, a bit of a hothead. Um, the younger sibling of one of the Hashiras, the white haired one. Um, but yeah, so he can like stay alive. Like he's got some like, it sounds weird to say he's got some like demon powers or something going on, which is interesting because he seems to be able to regenerate a bit because being stabbed like pretty bad there would kill most people, especially pulling it out. But he's not dying. He is still going and giving it. So it seems like he has regeneration kind of like demons do. But I don't think he's a demon because he seems very human. But I mean, Nesco is too. So maybe he has some weird thing going on with him as well. I'm not entirely sure. Um, or he's just like a master at <laughs> the breathing techniques or something. But I don't know. Seems rather demonic in nature since other people can't like regenerate like he can, which I'm going to call it regeneration, but it may not actually be regeneration. It might be called something else, but it seems like he's regenerating kind of. So very interesting. And then, yeah, also uses a sword and a gun, which is beyond interesting i know like guns and stuff exist in like the towns in our world it's just hard when we have the more feudal um looking environments most of the time of the show so when you see gun it's very like oh like very shocking when you see gun but again it's interesting i'm very excited to learn more about him and then we also learned uh a decent amount or at least Enough to make me stop hating uh, Tokito since Tokito has um, lost his memory and basically his memory is in a mist 
which I am assuming happened before he went to be a demon slayer. It seems like he became a demon slayer after uh, he lost his memory and then basically was given this second chance at life sort of thing to figure out himself and start doing this stuff and have like a purpose with his life. So very interesting. I'm curious kind of what Tokito's backstory was and kind of how it all came to be. Uh, along with that, we have our fight going on, which uh, the town is getting destroyed, which is not good. We have um, Mitsuri coming back, which is very great for us. Having one more Hashira will really help even out the score because we have a lot of demons right now. Technically, we only have two demons we are fighting, but we have um, Vase Man vase demon that can basically spawn just infinite other vase demons of lower class. And then we have um, anxious anxiety demon, which when cut, attacked, splits into more of itself of varying emotions and levels and strength as we keep uh, running into it. It seems like we may have found a slight, slight weakness by cutting the tongue. It didn't seem like it was super slow, but it did seem like we got a little bit of extra time if we cut the tongue. So very interesting. Um, Nesco's helping fight, which is awesome. I'm curious to kind of see her involvement with it more because we don't really want her to be fighting for fear that she might get stuck in demon mode. But it does seem particularly helpful to have her right now because we are very outnumbered with our current number, especially because we don't have Tokito with us. Tokito is off helping, going to be protecting the sword situation going on. So we will see what happens with all of this. I'm really enjoying this season. Um, I know it's kind of similar to last season where like, you know, it was like episode five, I think, where we started really getting into the action. I felt like we went quite a bit faster this season because fighting started last episode. So episode three. So we really kind of we have like two calm episodes, the first one being very long, of course. But we are just going, which was crazy to me i did not think we would get into fighting till like this episode maybe even five but i like it a lot i think it's fun to be already into it i like that we're already like problem solving and trying to figure out these upper ranked demons and it's just gonna be a, a lot this season and we're gonna have two hashiras which is great and also get to learn more about genya which is also exciting and interesting because I did not expect him to have like any regeneration powers like that, like demonic s powers. So I'm very excited to hopefully Tanjiro can befriend him and we can learn a bit more about what is going on with that character and why he can just get stabbed and it doesn't, you know, really face him or I should say it doesn't really unalive him. <laughs> So very interesting and I'm very excited to keep watching more Demon Slayer. I've really been enjoying it every week. I'm so glad that it is back because it is one of my favorites. Um, just visually, the animation is always so beautiful. So is the music and I love the... I love the humor that comes into the show and I feel like this season... I mean, last season did great too, don't get me wrong. But I feel like this season has had a lot of funny goofy moments and um as i've been looking it up very faithful adaptations from the manga like the same goofy um panel drawings were in the show as in the manga and i really like that so it's those little things that just really make you appreciate uh the attention the details and animation and just how great the production crew has done for it so I'm so excited for next week to continue watching more Demon Slayer. I hope you guys are as well. We will get a lot more pew, 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 and fighting. <laughs> so that'll be great. So 
Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Please make sure you go down and hit that subscribe button with your little pinky. That way I know you're super talented. And I will see you all later. Bye.